and that's a first down. Looking back to the years. We it's a great life. Good friends, good fun. Feeling all right. Ram it up. I'm ready to play. I know what I like. And we like it that way. going up against the Sanford Bulldogs on Saturday. Let's face it, Sanford going to be very overmatched in this game. It's all about what Auburn has to do. And quite frankly, that's play better on the offensive line. It's better quarterback play. Get Clint Mosley some confidence. Emory Blake reemerged as the top receiver at the go-to target. Got to get Michael Dyer more involved in the running game. It's all about getting prepared for the next game, the Iron Bowl. Sanford Bulldogs very similar offense to what Auburn runs. Rhett Lashley, the offensive coordinator, a protege of Gus Malzahn. So you're kind of going to see a mirror image of what they're going to try to do on the other side of the field. But most importantly about this game, I think, tribute to Pat Sullivan, the head coach of the Sanford Bulldogs. 40-year anniversary since his 1971 Heisman Trophy winning season. It's going to be a great day at Auburn. Great honor for Pat Sullivan. Well-deserved. Auburn fans, let's go out, let's support, let's find out what he's all about. Now, he's going to be on the other sideline trying to beat Auburn when it comes to playing the football game. But look, Auburn's finally got to take care of business. They've got to find a way to get some continuity on offense. we got to get off the field on third down. Turnover is another big key. Got to get ready. Got to get confidence when that Iron Bowl comes around. Unfortunately, it will come at the cost of the Sanford Bulldogs. Auburn Tigers. Let's get ready for a big win on Saturday. Al Del Greco from the opening drive, weekday morning, 6 to 10, right here on Jocks 94.5.